Okay, so going back to the music aspect, what what is your genre? My genre is also hard to define. Okay. <laughs> That's like another hard question. I would say that it come, it stems from the folk or singer-songwriter genre because uh, originally I'm an acoustic guitar player, but I also play some electric on some of my songs. But from there, I, for instance, I have a weekly original jazz show. So I have a lot of jazz music that I have written, and then one of the local jazz bars here, the main local jazz bar, has um, booked me as a weekly performer. So I go there every Friday and play a selection of my jazz material. Sometimes I pepper it with the odd jazz standard, but I have enough jazz material in my 13 albums to put on a show. Plus I have um, lots of pop and rock that stand outwards from the singer-songwriter material. I have huh? some reggae tunes. I have some. I have an entire album of electronic meets folk, so so folktronica music. Very cool. It came out in 2009 as sort of an experimental album. It's one of my favorite pieces of work because it's so different from what I had done before. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so I think it goes across many style genres. Hard okay. Good. I just preparing myself for what I'm going to listen to when I jump on there and download some stuff. Are you, are, are we able to download you anywhere? Course, Spotify? Yeah, I'm on all the platforms, all the Spotify, platforms. Um, you know, it, iTunes, YouTube. Um, and of course on all the Chinese platforms as well, where I have an even stronger following having been here for more than 15 years. And that includes like uh, QQ music and Wang Yi music and Douyin and all that stuff.